Mr. Curzy here. Here's a question about a sector of a circle. We're asked to find the length of this major arc A all the way round to B, which is a fraction of the whole circumference of this circle. So what fraction of the whole circumference is it? Well, the angle at the centre for the whole circle that goes with the whole circumference would be 360 degrees. So it's 320 compared to 360. It's that fraction, 320 compared to 360, it's that fraction of the whole circumference. Now, we know the circumference is pi times the diameter. In this case... The diameter would be twice this radius. Diameter goes all the way across the circle. That's twice 7.4. That's 14.8. So there's the calculation that we need to do. 320 divided by 360 times pi. Let's use the pi button. Times 14.8. And we get an answer of 41.329. Now, there's no indication as the accuracy uh, that they're requiring, so let's just approximate it to three significant figures. So that'd be 41.3, chopping a 2 off, the 3 remains as a 3. So 41.3 centimetres, and that's accurate to three significant figures. Now, there are other ways of doing it. One of the ways, the other ways that we could do it is to start off with the 360 degrees and to say, well, what kind of arc goes with that? Well, it's the whole circumference, pi times diameter, so that's pi times the 14.8. So, suppose we reduce that, suppose we will have only one degree. So, I have a tiny little sliver of an arc that goes with one degree. If 360 degrees goes with this number, one degree will be a 360th of that. We'll have to divide that whole circumference by 360. So that's the tiny wee sliver of an arc that goes with one degree. Now let's expand that to give us our 320 degrees. If we know one degree goes with this length, 320 degrees will go with this length times 320. It will be 320 times bigger. And if we multiply by 320, that will appear in the top of the fraction. And we basically here have the same calculation that we had before. Remember before... We had 320 times pi times 14.8 divided by 360. So there's a divide by 360 and pi times 14.8 times 320. It's just in a slightly different order. So that's an alternative way of doing that calculation. 41.3 centimetres to three significant figures. So that's Mr. Corsi signing out and thanks for watching this video.